Hey guys, Jay Real here in a shirt that's way <laughs> too small for me. Ricky gave me a child large to do this video, but why not, right? Makes me look more buff, maybe. All right, if you're a chrome dome like me, uh, and you travel or are just out in the sun in the middle of the day in the surf, you need to protect the melon, right? Because melon, melanoma, not good, right? So skin cancer can be prevented with good sunscreen and coverage. So let's go through the surf hats that we sell here at ebodyboarding.com. Let's start with this one. Uh, this one's from Creatures of Leisure. This is a one size fits all. It's more of like a sort of a dad cap kind of a setup here. And it has a Velcro adjustment on the back. So I don't know if this is adjusted to my gigantic head, but let's find out. Yep, it does fit. My head isn't actually that big, um, but let's, <laughs> no comments from the peanut gallery. So here are the features of this hat that are pretty cool. Obviously it has more of a regular sort of a cap look rather than the bucket hat. Some people may or may not like that. Nice firm bill so that when you duck dive, what was that? We're getting uh, help from the, from the videographer here. Uh, so that when you duck dive, the bill doesn't flop down over your eyes. The other nice feature is the ear covers, because let's face it, a lot of people forget about the ears. That's some tender skin. They forget to put sunscreen on it. So your ears are covered, but there is some mesh here so you can still hear. And you have this nice, flexible, elastic chin strap. So you can clip it under your chin and it'll stay on when you duck dive. As I mentioned already, you have this Velcro in the back so you can adjust it to make it more tight. And you have this lanyard, which you can connect to a wetsuit or a rash guard if you're wearing one. So that's a nice handy feature just in case the hat does happen to come off. Okay, so that's that one. And we have it in a couple different colors. This is the FCS. This is a bucket hat, so a little more coverage. It'll uh, throw some shade onto your face, onto your ears, onto the back of your neck. And again, it has a clip set up right here, which I am uh, uh, unclipping right now. And you'll see this has similar features. It has the lanyard on the back, which again, you can connect to a rash guard uh, or a wetsuit. It also has some ventilation under there to let some air get in underneath. And this is, by the way, all these quick dry fabric. It's really um, the kind of fabric that dries fast if there's any sort of a breeze. So it's not going to like soak up the water and be heavy on your head. This one, uh, this particular brand, the FCS brand, does not have covering for the ears, which some people like. They don't want their ears to be covered. But of course, when you have this on, your ears are shaded by the wide brim here. And again, the clip under the chin. Uh, we go back to the Creatures brand for their version of the bucket hat. And again, you have ventilation with mesh right here on each side of the hat. You also have the clip underneath. You just pinch it, unclip it. And again, we go with the lanyard here. And the Creatures hat, as we saw on the uh, dad hat, has the ear coverings with the mesh. So again, this has really good sun protection in that it has the wide brim plus the ear coverings. And again, comes in uh, different sizes and colors. So there's some options for you if you want to cover your head, whether you have hair or not, really important to cover up and uh, you know keep the sun from cooking you out there. And that is it for our surf hats. <laughs>